YouTube, how's it going? Today what we're going to be doing is learning how to make it so the red X button in the top right corner of your application in Visual Basic does not work. Uh, basically what it's going to do is just going to cancel the action. So basically what you want to do is go ahead and create a new project and name it whatever. <clears throat> this is going to be really simple you guys. So you're going to double click <clears throat> your form may not be form one, it may be whatever you named it. You're gonna go under and find form closing. Under form closing, you're gonna type e.cancel equals true. And uh, so basically when you play this, debug it, it's not gonna let that work. So what you might wanna do is create like some kind of way so you can exit out of it without being complicated, you know, like going into the processes, exiting out of it, you know. So, <clears throat> one way we can do this is just add a checkbox. And we can create a if function. If checkbox one dot checked equals true, then do nothing. Else, we're going to have it cancel, okay? Now let's go ahead and run this. So we know that when it's unchecked, we can't exit out of it, but when it is checked, we can. So that's great, you guys. Uh, that's all basically for this video. You can do other things with this, make it more complicated. Uh, I am going to put this code in the description. Uh, feel free to look at it. Feel free to even do whatever you want with this code. And I hope you guys enjoyed. Please comment, rate, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys next time.